Hey y'all, it's sunshine. Happy Sunday to ya. Sunday was, to church was just really good today. Um, Brother Gene preached and he normally does not preach. And I absolutely loved it. He did a fantastic job. Absolutely, you killed it. Absolutely. Um, one of my friends from church gave this to me. It's a little yarn bowl. You put your yarn through here or here. And um, it's got a what, ring on it, silicone ring type thing to where um, it won't scoot across the desk. This says yarn valet. So I'm guessing that's where it came from. But it's so cool. And I really like it. And I cannot wait to use it. And, um... Ooh, my phone is dirty. I'm going to have to rinse it off. Yes, you can rinse off Samsung's. It don't matter if they get wet. When you have questionable stuff on your phone, you learn this early in life. <laughs> I've even dropped that bad boy in the toilet one day while I was out somewhere. And it still worked. I did not use it. I let it soak in rice and then I des and then I had to sanitize it, but yeah. It was a clean toilet bowl, but not very clean, you know, public. Anyway, so I had this Etsy favorited and today the owner sent me a coupon and a deal I could not refuse. So I got I picked it up. I I have been really hesitant about buying patterns because honestly I can't afford it but another part of me is like no you don't need no patterns you don't need any patterns um so because I have a heaven and earth I still can't get $33 up to get the fabric so that's gonna have to wait um but anyways let me show you this let me figure out which hand's going to work the best. It says, I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. So, it was a cute little pattern and I was like, I want that pattern, you know? And I got a coupon for it and I, I couldn't say no. I mean, I'm like, hello. If I'm being gifted a coupon, there's a sign. So, anyways, I was also looking through my magazine uh, from Halloween 2016. And I saw this pattern. And they did it on, I, I don't even know, it's some 28 count lamb's wool linen. I'm not doing 28 count. Y'all know 14 count is the only place I be. But, this is what it looks like. Now, I want to do this, but I think I'm going to try to find a 14 count um, neon orange. Or, I may do it on black Ada with neon orange thread. But that was really cute. I thought, oh, I need to make that. So, I saw that one. And then, the other pattern. Y'all know I love my samplers. The, the tall ones, not the square ones. These are kind of, I call them bull pit bell pulls because they kind of look like bell pull patterns, but they're not. They're, they're samplers. And um, this one's just up and, I like the up and down ones, like I've been working on. But here it is. Isn't that cool? Let me see if I can... Oof. That better? But they have some really good patterns in this one. And um, I definitely plan on... Um, definitely got a lot of choices in this one that I like. Um, 
Oh yeah, there's the other one. Let me show you that one. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Tell me this is not cute. This one is the Frosted Pumpkin Stitcher. You know the cutesies ones that you know you know? This one, I knew immediately that it was the Frosted Pumpkin. How cute is that one? So, there's so much goodness in this magazine today that I found. Well, and I only found it from cleaning. So, I was like, well, let me look in these. I haven't looked in these in a long time. And I found those patterns and I was like, yep, that's what I want to do. So, um, I, I want to get into more colored Ada. Um, cause I mean, I, I do everything on white, it seems. And I just want some color. And what got me thinking about that is, uh, let me show you. I found this in my collection. It's not going to show up right on the, on camera, but it's a gorgeous hand dyed piece. And I know somebody died, had to dye it for me. I just can't remember who. Because I've had it in, in a box for a very, very long time. But the, um, the camera's not doing it justice. It's just not. And I've got to thinking, you know, I really, really like colored Ada. I like that hand-dyed look. Um... So, it's going to be more expensive than white, but, you know, I think that's a good choice. And it doesn't have to be colorful every time. Maybe a khaki or a stormy gray or something, something, you know. Ooh, that scalp, that skull would be cute on a stormy gray piece and the orange floss. Or any floss. Stormy gray and purple would be really pretty. So yeah we'll just have to see what i can find um right now fabric is not an option because the budget um when i can get patterns for under five dollars then okay i'll grab one but when fabric is 20 to 30 to 40 dollars i can't afford that so it is what it is um So, anyway, that's what I've got for y'all today. Um, it's just, it's been a good Sunday. It really has. And uh, it's always so good to see my church family. You know, because there's times where I just cannot be happy, sunny, go lucky. You know, everybody knows me for just being happy. And that's a hard, hard act to do when you have depression you know I don't want to be one of those woe is me kind of people and I don't want that and I was telling one of my friends at church that I was like because she said you weren't here last week and I said it's just hard when you feel woe is me and depressed and everything and then try to go to church when everybody knows you as happy go lucky she says, honey, that's when you need to be in church so we can pray for you. And I was like, yeah, that's true, you know. I just don't like to bother people. I don't like to burden anybody else. I have no problem listening to people. I may not have answers, but I have no problem listening to people. And I, you know, I just feel like a burden if I, if it switches, you know, different way. And, uh, but I've got to lean more on, you know, my friends, because they are, that's what they're there for. They're there to help. And, um, I, I need to give them that opportunity. So, anyway, thank y'all so much for watching. Have a great day. And tomorrow should be the floss that um, Miss Beth died for me. So, 
hopefully it will be here tomorrow and I am so excited to see it I have not seen any pictures I've not seen any previews I have not seen anything so my reaction is going to be the live reaction you don't want to miss it y'all take care